Stool Britannia. From Cardigan to Cromer, from Stirling to St Ives, last year UK water companies pumped raw sewage into our rivers and coastal areas 301,000 times. I'm Barry Sludge and I'm a sewage operative who's committed to clearing up for our shareholders. Since becoming the only country on earth to privatise its entire water supply, the UK has paid out over 57 billion in leveraged debt dividends. And it's not just a national success story, it's an international one too, because 71% of that wealth went straight overseas to the hedge funds of Malaysia, China and the USA. However, it's not all good news. For some reason, our infrastructure is now so dilapidated the only pipe we've got left that doesn't leak is the one we're siphoning huge sums of money out of the country in. And there is a very real risk in 2023 that we will not be able to pay our CEOs their Christmas bonuses. Now I know what you're thinking. What can I do to help? Well, the answer's simple. Earlier today, I drove to my local site of special scientific interest and babbed straight into the chalk stream there, thus relieving the pressure on both my bowels and our crumbling Victorian sewer network. Other than a startled dog walker and an angler who was sick of himself, it was just so reassuring to know I was putting some much needed liquidity straight into a Texan billionaire's pocket. So the next time you need to go, why don't you think of those CEOs and shareholders, cut out the middleman and turn your effluence into affluence. Oh yeah, and for those people who've been accusing us of greenwashing, let me just say this. There's no way I'd wash my hands with UK water. It's disgusting.